Hello friend, welcome back to this lesson. And the last video we have learned the licensing of RDA server and how we done the licensing. Like there are the three components was there: telephonic, web access, as well as the automatic. It required the internet connection that we have done. If you look at the server here, this is the, our RDA server we have configured and we have done three options here. Correct. And we have configured all these things and in this server I have installed all these roles and we have done. Okay, so now I will tell you how we, uh, you know, give the multiple uh, session, provide the multiple session per user. So there are the different options are there, so you can do it. Uh, there is one option if you, you know, open the run command and put it like uh, gp uh, edit dot msc. It will open the local group policy here on the server where you can go to the uh, computer setting, computer configuration. Uh, because there are the two configuration are there user configuration as well as the computer configuration in computer configuration we can setting the computer computer group policies and the user configuration we can setting the user uh, group policy in the computer configuration you need to go to the administrative template here once you click the administrative template again you need to go to the um, windows components here and uh, in the windows component if you look at there should be rd uh, remote desktop service yes this is the remote desktop services if you expand it uh, there should be a remote desktop session host because i have configured this role in the server that's the reason it is showing okay if the normal server it cannot be shown, okay so if you look at here in the remote desktop session host there should be a connection in this connection if you there are the lot of settings are there and different settings have different work but uh, for our it's a multiple session so if you go look at here there's a restriction remote desktop service user a single remote desktop service it is not configured it that means it's for the single user but if you want to configure if, if you look at here if you disable this policy setting user are allowed to make uh, unlimited simultaneous remote connection by using remote desktop service so this is what you no need to enable this this is the disable if you read this uh, statement you can get to know that how user will get the multiple session here okay so for that i'll just disable here apply okay so now user can uh, the multiple session there is another way also we can uh, configure here so this is the how the local through local group policy we can do it and uh, there is one more option like if you go to the just run command and uh, type res edit I know I think you know guys uh, the word this is the command it's uh, it will open the registry poll here in the registry poll if you look at here where I will go if you look at here I go the computer uh, I went like uh, local machine here computer local machine system uh, current uh, state uh, let me let me uh, do these things proper and then we'll go okay so just open the local machine here and go to the system here in the system there is a current control set okay in the current control set there should be a, a policy uh, sorry control and this control uh, just such the terminal server here and the terminal server there is option called okay f single session per user so this is the uh, one is that if you do it zero then it should be unlimited uh, sessions for user okay just put it zero okay if you press okay it should be unlimited correct so this is the way we can configure the unlimited session of a user and um, i showed you like two ways through res edit to registry entry advisor as well as the group policy right so thanks for watching this video if you really like my video if you're enjoying my video please do not forget to subscribe my channel because uh, i'm i'm excited to you know giving the new training here and uh, i always try to do some you know good technology and uh, uh, presenting in place uh, in front of you so i hope uh, you will um, you know um, increase my viewers increase my you know you can like my all the videos and uh, you can subscribe my channel so i can you know get more chance to do all these things so thank you very much guys if you have any question you can put it in comment so i will try to you know give answer as soon as possible thank you